Now this one is about building relationships. So you can almost expect to get a similar question on your interview because building relationships, whether it's with other departments, whether it's with customers, whether it's with vendors, third party, it doesn't matter. Um, this type of question can be used in almost any kind of interview. So here's the question. Number five, it's very important to build good relationships at work, but sometimes it doesn't always work. Can you tell me about a time when you were not able to build a successful relationship with a difficult person? This is a great question. I love it. So first we're going to talk about the situation. I was assigned to work on a project with someone outside of my department who I had never met. Initially, we were able to work alongside each other just fine. But as we spent more time together, he consistently missed work. He wouldn't complete his portion of the project and he just got frustrated with me for not picking up the slack. At first, I was furious. I was new to my position and well, I wanted to make a good impression, but he made it difficult to be a positive force in the workplace. All right, second, let's talk about the action. This is, uh, this is what we did. I worked with my boss to facilitate interdepartment communication, which resulted in less face time with my coworker to complete a project. Okay, and last, let's talk about the result. This is what happened. The time we worked together was reduced to meeting once a week to follow up with each other on how our portion of the project was progressing. Anything that was not completed was up to that worker's department to finish. We ended up finishing a few weeks later than we expected. I'm sure we would have finished the project sooner if we had kept working together, but I'm also sure I would have done most of the work. But the extra three weeks it took to complete the project was not an issue for the company. So even in this case, the project took longer than expected and there were issues of working with people. But you know what? In the end, the project got completed. And that's the most important thing. And when you can, when you can use an answer like this, you can show that you're able to work through situations. Now, it would, it would have been bad if you weren't able to complete the project at all. But in this case, you found a way to work through the project, even though it meant not working together, but you're able to split apart and uh, separately work on different angles of the project to meet at the end and complete it, which is a success. Even though it took longer, it's still a success. And when you can present a solution like that to an employer, it shows that you are resourceful. It shows that you persevere and you just don't quit. If you want to download a copy of the PDF document, you can go to jobinterviewtools.com slash star. I'll also put a link below this video where you can go there. Just put in your email address and you can download the PDF. All right, that's all I have for you today. Good luck on your next interview and I will see you in the next video. Bye now.